Hello everybody, happy 2012. Um, I hope you all had a fun and safe celebration. I know I did, visiting with friends and family, it was awesome. I know a lot of you are now battling those New Year's resolutions. Um, just stay positive, stay focused, remind yourself over and over and over again that you're doing it for the right reasons and you will succeed. So good luck with that. I myself, I do have a New Year's resolution. It is to continue to encourage inspiration so others aspire. I want to continue spreading happiness and cheer to the world and continue to inspire people to do beautiful things. Um, my friend had suggested that I make videos, more videos, to kind of teach people or tell people about the things that I love and you know why you should love them too. So this is part of my creativity as well. So this is part of my new year's resolution. So I'll be doing this more often, maybe more than once a week. We'll find out. It depends on how inspired I am. So anyway, um, first topic is going to be artists. I love artists. I love art. I love creativity. I love passion. I love artist passion. Um, the thing is with artists, they have superpowers, or at least that's what I say. I say that artists have superpowers. They have the ability to make people see things in a different way that other people, that normal people just wouldn't. Um, it's fantastic. So like my friend Russell, he can grow anything on anything. He can grow a person on paper, you know, he can draw really well, he can paint on the wall. My, uh, my husband, my friend Niaz, my friend Derek, they're really good at writing, they have the power of word, they have the ability to plant the seed of thought in anybody's head and change their mind, that's so powerful. My, uh, my friend Jack, he can transcend multiple subjects and objects into one painting, his work is unbelievable. Um, my other friend Jeremy, he can throw pixels on your screen and make you see dreams within dreams, it's amazing the work that he can do too. But these artists have superpowers. I, I love supporting artists and what they do because, yeah, I'm an artist myself. I, I do my creative photography, light painting, poetry, um, soon to be making music, experiences, event planning. But the thing is, I know that there are a lot of other people who are more talented than me, so I love supporting them and their passions because I appreciate what they do and what they give to the world and the community with their superpowers, as I do say. So, just think of this, wouldn't it be cool if artists use their superpowers in a positive way, you know, to positively influence their communities or just the world? And then think on a larger picture, imagine if all of these artists came together with their superpowers and created something super awesome and positive, they could totally change the world. I totally believe that. I really think that artists could change the world if they put their minds in the right places. I really do. So, um, that said, um, support your local artists. I know for myself with the, the art shows that I have done, um, I just want people to take home my work to feel inspired, to feel happy. I'm not really trying to make money off of it. It's not my full-time job. It's just a hobby. But, you know, honestly, I really I really want people to, to think of something beautiful and have something positive to think about in their own thoughts when they look at it. So go and get something, you know, some artwork to make your own thoughts rather than just sit on the couch and watch TV, you know. I don't watch TV. I don't enjoy it at all. I don't have cable, so. <laughs> anyway, so um, yeah, there was my food for thought. Uh, thank you so much for listening. I really appreciate it. We all, uh, we all should listen to each other a little bit more. We really could learn a lot from each other about ourselves and about the world if we just all stopped and listened to each other. So with that said, um, continue to encourage inspiration so others aspire. And yeah, one love. I promise I'll get better at making these, okay? <laughs> Alright.